here's a Scalby 8B, the business version of the Selby computer. And there's only about four of these in collections that we know of at this time, so we're certainly delighted to have this one. This one was built by uh, Robert Foreman out in Portland, Oregon in 1976. He purchased the cards from the factory and built this computer around the cards. And you see it's uh, computer itself is surrounded by a nice wooden frame, and they placed everything within that frame. The uh, Selby computer itself is uh, consisting of these six cards back here and a motherboard down below. Here's a switch register to the uh, computer and uh, interrupt, step, and run switch. And moving on around here and looking a little bit at the side, look inside here at these cards. I said these are the uh, six cards that make up the Shelby computer itself and the motherboard down below that they're plugged into. By looking at the back of the computer we see the back of the six uh, Shelby cards in the computer and the motherboard down here and the interface uh, connections and the I.O. connections for TV display, audio output, cassette, no built-in power supply, so these are the connections for the power supply. And moving around on the far side of the computer, we see some special interface cards that Robert built into this. Uh, these are custom interface slots that he built, and back here on the back, this card with the gold chip is a digital group uh, TV typewriter card or video card. And as far as these custom interface cards, this is just an I.O. port. And over here, he has the uh, cassette interface, audio cassette interface. And here's the bottom of the motherboard or bottom of the computer as it's in the wooden frame. And the lower part here is the main motherboard for the computer itself. Mr. Foreman did a really nice job of wiring. I'll get in a little close here where you can see how bright some of his solder connections are and how he labeled some of the connections, tied the wires together nicely. This is the main motherboard of the computer. <clears throat> Here's the lower section for that TV typewriter card that he wired in there and labeled a lot of the signals and up above that is the the bus connectors for the custom interface cards that we we looked at and um, over here is the TV typewriter see how he tacked the wires down and tied them together did a really nice tidy job and Roberts had a lot of good information and manuals along with the computer here's the uh, Shelby machine language programming uh, manual for the 8008 PC card assembly instructions for the 8B assembly and information instructions for the 8B and system. And I understand there were only four newsletters that were ever written. The Selby Computer Digest, he sent all four issues along. There was number one. And four, and of course, these were written by Nat Wadsworth and Robert Finley. In addition to this information, a very large three ring binder with enormous amount of information in it, another manual for the uh, 8H. And here's an early assembly manual for the 8H computer. This has got a date on it of March 9, 1979. Here's a very interesting thing. I'm certainly glad to have this. It's the original purchase order for the six cards dated 7875, signed by Robert Finley. Robert was the co-founder of 
Shell me computing and what's uh work. So here's the uh, order for the original six cars in the back plane that uh, Robert used to build this.